Man, what's up y'all? JSB the Creator and I am back again with a new video today for y'all. Have y'all missed me? No. Because I'm back. We do not care. In today's video, I'm going to be working on something a little bit different. I know you hear me say that, but for real, for real, this is something different. I've literally never done this ever before, ever in my entire life. So this is something that's an experience for both of us Aww. to embark on. So for today's video, I know you're wondering, what am I going to be working on? Well, I'm going to be working on this. This. Yes, yeah, some regular old dress shoes. Yeah, what? Yeah. Picked up some cheap dress shoes from Nordstrom Rack. My best friend has a birthday celebration coming up. And for his birthday celebration, it's a professional affair. Black tie, gotta wear a suit, gotta be fresh, gotta be fly, right? Well, I wanna be fly and different. You know, I could've got me some nice little loafers from Aldo or somewhere, you know what I mean? Like how I usually do, you know, I don't sleep on the fresh game in no sense, all right? But I wanna try something different. So I picked up a pair of these and I'm about to pimp these out. I'm about to make them look extra fresh. All right, we're gonna keep them black. We might throw some different material on them, but either way, they're not gonna look like this. They're gonna be different. So get a good glimpse of them. Mm-hmm. Cause they ain't gonna be looking like this after I'm through with them. So they either gonna come out fly or they gonna come out super fly. So let's get it popping. Bam. <laughs> So first things first, I got to get my material. So I got my black python straight from Wakanda. Got my velvet material straight from a pimp named Slipback. And I got my spikes straight off of Bowser's shell. So I'm using the masking tape to help me map out where I will be placing those materials and how large I will be cutting them. So I'm using a lighter to burn off any extra fizz that came out from me cutting out these little velvet pimp patterns. Now I'm going to use my hole puncher to cut around the collar so that I have a place to place my spikes. The spikes are pretty simple. They have a screw on one end. You place it on the other end, put the spike in and just screw them in. Now I'm going to be using the contact cement glue to glue all those fly pieces of fabric and material that I cut out onto the shoe. After applying pressure and letting them dry, this is how they came out. Next up is to create my tassel pieces. So I had to dye these tassels up. I'm gonna take my hole puncher, punch the holes for where I'm putting the tassels because I will be putting them on the tongue. Grab my wire, my wax wire, put them through the tassels, put the tassel uh, strings through the holes I just punched with a toothpick because it is kind of hard to get them in there and tie the back ends so it will complete the footwear and bam look at that thing even my nephew had to come in and check them out himself and based on his reaction to them i believe i got his approval so these are certified heat Once again, guys, thanks for checking out today's video I did on these lemon pepper steppers. Add to the song, man, if you got them shit on, look. Look, I say, hey, bitch, I got the motherfucking lemon pepper steppers. Lemon pepper steppers. Oh, step I told y'all these are gonna come out fly or super fly, and I think they came out super duper, duper fly, so I was wrong. My bad. But yeah, this is my first pair of dress shoes that I have done. Um, they came out very grown, very sexy, and I can't wait to rock them. And actually, because they came out the way that they came out, much better than I expected, I'm going to start doing dress shoes, all right? I'm going to start doing loafers. Um, I'm going to start, you know, offering that service for people. I might actually start just buying loafers and just selling them. I do have a website coming soon, so I might throw that as an option on there. It might 
buy a couple loafers, a couple dress shoes, you know, from Ross or Nordstrom and wherever I may find a pair and, and do them up nice. You know, I got the spikes going on right here. Got the black snake skin wrapped around. Got the little velvet toe box right there with the gold and black tassels. Um, but yeah, you know, these Ken's Coles went from, you know, beaters to heaters real quick. But yeah, as usual, as I usually say, don't forget to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And don't forget to check me out till next time, guys. And uh, enjoy your day, night, or whatever it is, wherever y'all at. And peace! I can't wait to rock these for my boy's birthday. And uh, yeah, maybe I might show y'all a picture of the update. Maybe make a little YouTube short with me wearing these with my suit. And so y'all can see how I put the outfit together. But like I said, I love being fly. I love being fresh. And these are grown and sexy. And I cannot wait to do more like this. This was fun and easy. And uh, yeah, real fashion designer ish right there, right? JSB Creator, and I am out. Hey.